Hello, I'm Kim Mitchell. A little bit about my background. I was born in Vietnam during the war. My mother had been killed and I was found along the side of the road. I was fortunate enough to be picked up and placed in a hat, brought to uh, a bridge and then given to a South Vietnamese Marine who found a way to get me to the orphanage in Da Nang, the Sacred Heart Orphanage. He gave me the name of Tran Thi Nok Bic, meaning precious pearl. And I, even though I was in the orphanage for a few months, a U.S. airman who was stationed at the air base in Da Nang came over one day and decided that he wanted to adopt a child. And so I was the fortunate one to be adopted. I spent most of my childhood in Northern Wisconsin where I played basketball and did everything, but I knew I had a life of service. So I decided to go to the United States Naval Academy and then join the Navy. I spent 17 years in the Navy and had a great time being on board ship and uh, doing, seeing the world and doing a whole lot of things. And then I got out in 2012 and have been in the nonprofit space ever since. I co-founded a nonprofit in Washington, D.C. and ran that for five years and then came out here to San Diego in 2017 to run Veterans Village of San Diego. And then in March of this year, I started a new job as senior vice president here at National University where I can really work to create educational programs for our service members, veterans and their families, because I do believe that education coupled with meaningful employment and access to our healthcare and wellness is the key to successful reintegration for our families. Hey, I'm Cindy Morgan and I was so excited to write with Kimberly Mitchell um, on both of these songs, um, Precious Pearl and um, the Old Glory Honor Flight. And writing with Kim, I mean, just like knowing about her story and how she has used her entire life to serve um, and to be a part of like making other people's lives better. She is just an amazing human being and amazing human beings have amazing stories. And, and as a songwriter, it's just incredible uh, to get the chance to write songs about those incredible people and the stories and the things that they have been involved in in their life. And so I'm so grateful that Operation Song invited me to be a part of Kimberly's story and her songs. So I'm so excited to be a part. I hope you guys enjoy the songs. I was connected to Operation Song through the Veterans History Project and through then Bob at Operation Song connected to Miss Cindy Morgan, uh, who uh, it's been just a wonderful experience working with her. Uh, she was able to really capture the emotion and the feeling of a couple of stories that I told her. Uh, the story about how my name of Tran Thi Nok Bic, meaning precious pearl, and Bao Tran, the South Vietnamese Marine who brought me to the orphanage, and then my parents and my father choosing me at the orphanage. And so hopefully uh, you enjoy the songs. Thank you. Search for a photograph 
Something to bring you back You saw a treasure Instead of a landmine You said I was your precious Father, a mother, always wanted a daughter. So long to find You said I was your precious A couple years ago, I was invited to Washington, D.C. for Veterans Day to give a speech at the Vietnam Veterans Memorial. While I was in Washington, D.C., I was invited over to the Library of Congress to the Veterans History Project to share my story because it was a great opportunity to not only uh, give a, an oral history of, of my story and what influenced me and what inspired me growing up but also to talk about what I'd been through, my ex experiences that I've had, and then what I'm doing now. They boarded a flight, oh. Pretty soon they touched down This place to most of us Is hallowed ground They 
They went to see Lincoln, took pics on the mall, paid respects to the greatest generation of all. And they knelt at the wall and they took off their caps for their Vietnam brothers who never came back. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. 